the arrival, following which uh, Mr. Pompeo is expected to have a working dinner with his Excellency President Dr. Muhammad Irfan Ali. Now, tomorrow is said to be a busy day for the head of state and the highest ranking U.S. diplomat. There is expected to be an agreement, a sign, a sign, an agreement is supposed to be signed between the two that will permit Ghana to improve its investment enabling environment so that the country can benefit from transferred infrastructure investment that respects Ghana's sovereignty. We've just witnessed the arrival of the U.S. Secretary of State, Mr. Mike Pompeo, landing on local soil for the very first time. He is the highest ranking U.S. official to visit Ghana since its independence in 1966. In terms of U.S. relations to Ghana, according to the U.S. Embassy in Georgetown, U.S. policy towards Ghana seeks to develop robust, sustainable democratic institutions, laws and political practices, support economic growth and development, promote an active, organized and empowered civil society, and promote stability and security. All right, there is the delegation. They're now leaving, and this delegation is expected, of course, to meet with the president of Ghana. From the Chedi Jagan International Airport, I'm Felicia Valenzuela with the videographer Keon Blades.